Hi, this is Vi Adkins of FormostResumes.com. In this screencast, I'm going to show how to add a custom watermark, an image, to a Microsoft document. I have a new document open here that I've inserted placeholder text into. To add a watermark, I'm going to go up here at the top. You see I'm on the Home tab. Over to the right of that is the Page Layout tab, and I'm going to select that. And on the Page Layout ribbon, you see one of the choices in Page Background section is Watermark. If you click on the down arrow, you have several choices. One of the choices is Custom Watermark. Select that. That brings up the Printed Watermark dialog box. I want to select Picture Watermark and the Select Picture button, which will allow me to browse my hard drive for the picture I want to use. Let me go to my website files where I have a logo for my business. And I'm going to select this pen logo that I use and click on the Insert button and choose OK. I'm going to scroll down a bit. You can barely see the faint watermark behind this document. If I double click at the top of the document, I will go into header mode. You see the header tab appear. Scroll down a bit and now the cursor turns into a four arrow cursor. If I click now, I select the watermark image. You can tell because these handles appear around the image. I want to make the image smaller, so if I select, press the shift key, and I then I can drag the bottom right handle, and I can reduce the size of that watermark image. Now I want to raise the image up a bit, kind of center it in the text. And then I can exit the header footer mode. So I double click the header tab here to go back into the normal mode for my document. And I don't know if you can see it on this screencast video, but the watermark image is there behind the text. That's how you add a watermark image to a Microsoft Word 2010 document.